In this uh, detailed overview video, I want to go over the super admin with you, okay? Uh, the super admin is going to allow you to centralize all your hosting for the mobile websites that you're going to be building for your clients. It's going to allow you to do rapid development with its cloning feature and it's also going to allow you to do um, prospecting with its prospecting functions. So in this first video of three videos I'm going to put together for us to go over the, the system in great detail, I just want to cover how you can quickly and easily uh, create a site and start working with it. So let's go over this. So the first thing you're going to notice is that you're going to have a complete list of every site that's in the system. Okay, When you click on the blue button, the manage button, that takes you out to the individual content management system or CMS for that particular website. This green button, you can deactivate and activate a site. Let's say um, someone doesn't make payment, you can quickly and easily deactivate it. Like say uh, Italian Cafe didn't pay their bill, I can simply click on that and click OK. And now when we look at this, it's deactivated. And so they're, they're showing a, a page on the home page. It basically replaces the home page with a you know, please contact support and with a link out to your support site that you set up here in the settings area. Okay, so let me turn that one back on. Next, you're able to delete any site out of the system that you want, okay? simply by clicking on the delete button. The export button is going to give you the ability to actually export the site. What it does is it zips up all the files and downloads it to your computer. So let's say you have a client that doesn't want you to be centralizing their hosting but they want to actually put it on their client's um, own domain. You can do that. Now I personally host all of my clients and I've been doing that now for over two years and it really hasn't been an issue and and so when I'm working on the sites I can like I said I can come in here and work with them um, or one of my assistants can work with them very very easily and the purple button the email button this is the prospecting system and I'm going to cover that in video three so let's clone a site real easy so if let's say I want to build a, uh, a pizza site okay and I'm just going to go sample pizza. And what you want to do is make this probably your customer's name. It's going to, we're going to turn it into a subdirectory. So make sure it's something like this. And if you don't select any website to clone, uh, what you're going to do is have a base install and you'll have to create all the pages and start from scratch right from the beginning. So what I like to do since I work in verticals, I create some, I take the time and build out a website you know, somewhere between 50 and 60% of the way and then I can come in and finish it off. So let's clone a pizza site because we're going to work with that in the next video. And all I have to do is simply click on install and now I have a website to work with. And I'll just click on sample pizza and we'll find it real quickly. So you have the search function right here. So you know when that list gets really big, it can zero in right in on that. Uh, a couple more features I want to go over with you before we end up uh, end this video is that you can actually import any site too. So that zip file that's been exported, you could easily put it back in the system if you deleted it simply by you know navigating to it and then hitting the import button and it will import right back into the system. Also, um, you can do a full system backup by clicking on the backup button here and we'll zip up not only the super admin and the prospecting system but every single one of the client installs okay and in the campaign setting uh, we're gonna go over that in video 3 and that's the prospecting system so this wraps up the overview of what I like to call the super admin and in the next video we're gonna go in more detail on the content management system for this site so I'll see you in the next video